sometimes we are not in a mood or a state to do things uh, because of so many things that are going on so many stresses that we have in life and what happens is you're just not in a mood to do anything and but one thing that i do really respect when it comes to when it comes to holding on to momentum is when you are not feeling to do something and when you're still pulling it off in a way uh, i would truly respect that i 100% respect that because currently me myself is going through a storm today is what 17th of june 2022 a month since my birthday last month and since i'm going through my own phase of episodes in a way and currently i am not in a state to sit and record but then just one thing that i just want to do is because since from past almost close to 3 months right now i was close to close to 66 close to 80 days of recording a video consistent for two two videos a day i've been doing it and just today i'm just recording for the sake of recording i am not feeling like doing it and i don't i was not even coming with ideas of what to record today because when you are when you are clouded you are cloud nothing comes into you so why am i mentioning this to you when we start off you can even recognize that with my tone why am i mentioning you because of one reason is it's it's in in i think if you can boil down to one thing entrepreneurship it's all about momentum when we have a momentum please don't break the momentum no matter what happens no matter what challenges thrown on you that is the test and trial for the moment and when we pass through that when we go through that you are going to feel accomplished you are going to have a sense of accomplishment See, i pulled it off in that phase like huh, this phase is nothing for me so when you have that within you we are going to do so much greater things and one thing that we introverts are very very bad at is kind of breaking the momentum very fast because we get so over and we're like aaj bhool gaye we just don't know do it today and that becomes again in habit so if you are maintaining and holding on through the momentum i truly respect that i totally from from the bottom of my heart i totally respect that because it's not easy it's not easy it's never going to be easy but then when you just hold on to the rope of momentum it's just just barely hold it just don't let it go just hold on to it because greater things on are the flip side of it you might be just one struggle away from the success you want. you might be just one challenge away from the success you have and that you want and that you're looking for just like just one more like just just do you you must be exhausted and tired i am i am exhausted and tired like okay if i just pull this off for today this better tomorrow just keep on pushing through just pick up keep on pushing through i'm not asking you to hustle and stuff but then don't break the momentum of things that we already have built because it took courage it took time it took effort to even start doing something now that we are there we are doing it for like say 7 days 70 days just keep on pushing it keep on pushing it so that is thank you so much for joining this when we read this video is i don't know how how crazy this video is going to be something that i've come, that i'm giving it to you free one of the reasons is because i was not having ideas to what to record but then i was also okay keep one of the things that we have as core fundamental things of the academy of finance scientist is having the daily c as that's like the bottom is something that we do on a daily basis there are like seven things we'll be talking about this thing and you might you may again fail at a lot of things at first but at first because even though i say there is fundamental seven things that we have we've been doing it we we've been doing it we are doing it we some we start to do it but then we fail at it then we pick the moment the back and we fail at it we pick the moment the back and we fail at it so it's a matter of you just holding on to that rope barely and just 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 pushing through seven things that we need to be doing on a daily basis that i have been doing on a daily basis sometimes again i do it sometimes I fail at it first and foremost is first and foremost the fundamental thing is like track uh you are going outside track you are taking shower track you are eating food how many times track what food you are eating track what content you are recording track how much how many hours you are sleeping track how much stress do you have track how much how many how many hours do you sleep track how many how much time you spend on your business work family kids going outside meeting friends track 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 when you are tracking everything it's 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 one one core principle that i have when i'm recording when i'm tracking is okay with every tracking is every days of tracking is going to making a better person tomorrow that's all it's like a better person tomorrow or a better person today that is one intention that i started with one intention that i can just see the flow of it and when i'm pathetic when i when, when i know i'm doing something wrong i can fix it very easily if you miss out on things what is going to happen is you are not going to know what is missing out and what is missing things up so if you can track a lot of things you'll be find you'll be able to figure out a lot of things in your own life okay it's in your daily habits it's in your daily habits that changes that has a perspective of you can change things so if you can just try track or tracking or journal 
in this one channel you'll be able to find a lot of videos when i when it went deep into try helping you okay how do i have my journal with the framework and stuff so that even you can get benefited of this second one is something that i listen to all the time i have not been doing for like two months but prior to that two months i did for good straight 10 months so something there are two point number two and point number three is two videos slash audios that i listen when it comes to like when it comes to mindset programming sort of a thing one video is from gary v uh my heart my mind heart and soul the video's name is my mind heart and soul i'm going to give you the exact name of it you can just search on youtube and you'll be able to find the 15 minute of a video so that's something that daily ritual that i have inside my heart brain and soul the thumbnail is daily v 101 that one 15 40 point 27 14 minutes 27 seconds for a video you can just go ahead and watch that video because it, it helps you program yourself and set the tune of the day point number three is we have the less bronze video something that i really admire that person today's leaders are way different than the people who were there before us and he still lives but then he comes from like from 90s and 80s and 90s where he went through that grind and kind of resonate with that person this one the, the video the audio's name is you've got to be hungry it's like for 40 minute audio which i have been doing it for 10 months prior to two months so i have not been doing this but then i'm going to pick it again so these two things 40 minutes for 15 minutes generally what i do when i'm having the morning coffee after workout or morning coffee after the workout while i'm tracking and listen to this this is almost always used to be in my ears which is very impactful it sets the tone of it fourth then fourth basic thing that i used to do currently i'm not doing again in this one but then this is something that i want to do it fourth one is listening to something or watching something from the channel impact theory you can just search for impact theory on youtube there are like hundreds of videos on hundreds of topics just make a habit of going and visiting visiting the channel and just do window shopping of where you're struggling at the moment you can just pick anything that you want and you can learn you just watch like five minutes or ten minutes because there's immense amount of value they add and when you can do it just five minutes or six minutes or even ten minutes chill no problem 10 minutes 5 minutes 6 minutes but just make sure that oh this is a reminder for me as well like when you just tune into that mindset it helps a lot to us it helps it changes the perspective that sets the tone of the day so the four things the fifth one is something again i have been struggling for like last three years something called reading if you are like the book nerd or the reading book nerd put that in the comment section so that i really respect that because i have been working on so much on reading and i just couldn't hold on to that habit i pick and habit do it for a month break it pick and habit maintain it break it pick and habit maintain it break it so it's just a matter of momentum picking and feeling momentum picking and feeling but this is something that has been helping me immensely when i used to read last year where i read like around two books two two books in like two months though again that's small that's a short period of time to read that that's a long time to read that two books but then it was very helpful for me so reading something like a line or a page again this is a reminder for myself point number six is something that i'm a nerd of workout point number six is workout i've been doing it for like september october november 2021 three months straight 86 days and kind of got fever after that and started working out in the month of january january february march april May, june we are on sixth month and i've been doing consistently without breaking a single day's momentum when it comes to workouts like a daily physical activity has to be done come what now because it it helps you with when mind body and soul are eventually connected when you're going through an emotional phase what happens is if you are going through an emotional phase and acting you're going through an emotional phase where you just work out you have that sense of accomplishment when things are not getting right everything is in your control when it comes to physical activity it's up to you to do a physical activity no matter what is happening you can just take out like five minutes 10 minutes 15 minutes in 24 hours just for yourself if we can just do that we have control over the day even though we don't have control over the day but we have control over the workout point number seven is think about it it's one brick a day for building our own empire not an all-in empire but an empire it's just one brick a day think of these seven points as this is like okay what can i do today that that's going to contribute to the sand dream that i've got of that business idea that i've got of that the the, the billion dollar empire that i'm building for myself what is that one step that i need to be taking today that is going to contribute to the just one step so it's one brick a day so this one video for me that i'm recording i don't feel like recording it it's like i'm, I'm, I'm not, in, not in the mood to record it not in that state to record it but then this is just one video that is going to contribute to that empire just one small little brick that's all that's all we need to be working especially in rules 
we get lazy we procrastinate we get overwhelmed we get lost we get stuck very fast very quick so we are very productive and very little when it comes to like getting things done and maintaining the momentum but it also comes to a point where we also get lazy all the time so that brings us to the conclusion of this one we thank you so much for making this video part of your day part of your day this video me and the topic of all of your day next video that i'm going to record is something that i've learned in the morning one perspective to know when you are stuck that's the next video that i've recorded it's going to be a shorter video comparatively thanks so much i'm going to see you in that video